The Malaysian embassy is located just around the corner behind multiple lines of police. This is as close as we were allowed to get. 80 family members have been camping out across from the embassy. They've been there overnight. This is the second time that family members, people with relatives aboard the missing airplane, have protested outside the embassy. And their demands remain the same. They want more contact with the Malaysian government, and they want to be more involved in the search for the airplane. To the relatives' frustration, embassy officials stopped attending the family's daily briefings. And Malaysian Airlines employees don't have the authority to answer questions. The Malaysian authorities have been searching for the plane for 49 days, but we feel like we have been waiting for information for 49 years. We do not believe a single word said by the Malaysian government. The Malaysian government has never told us any truths or kept any promises. So the relatives have been telling us for weeks that they simply don't trust, they don't believe the Malaysian authorities. They think that they're withholding information on the plane's disappearance. So their hope today, in fact, their only desperate hope right now, is that by increasing contacts with high-level Malaysian government officials, they can all work together to end the search for the plane once and for all. Celia Hatton, BBC News, Beijing.